learning how to use the reminders on your iPad. So we're going to go into the reminders app. Over here we're going to be able to see which kind of list we've got, what we've completed, and just regular reminders. To add one, we can tap on a line or we can hit the plus button up here. So remind me to pick up more milk. Pretty easy. So once we've got that in there, pick up more milk, what else? Pick up fruits and veggies. So we've got a couple things in there. I'm actually going to set a reminder. If you tap back on the reminder you just added, it's going to show it. You're going to get some options to remind you on a specific day. We're going to pick Wednesday. Let's pick Christmas Day at 8 a.m. We're going to repeat. We don't want to actually repeat that, but you could repeat it every week, every day, every month, every year. Uh, your call on just how you want to have your reminder set up. A few more options, you can set a priority, if it's high, medium, or low, or no priority at all. And you can add some notes, anything you want to add in there. So if we want to add some specific reminders rather than just a reminders app, let's say we use a grocery list quite frequently. We can hit edit up here at the top left and create new list. Groceries, done. You can rearrange these using these, grab the three little lines gives us the option to rearrange those. You can create as many lists as you want, whatever helps you out. You can have a work list, a kids list, a, you know, whatever list. You can sort these by the list, or you can also sort by the date. Date's really cool because you can actually see specific days of the week. So if we go to Christmas, we should see that we need to pick up more milk. Shows it in there. Let's assume that we finish it. Go ahead and check that box and that's it. It's going to show up in the completed. And that's about it for reminders.